I'm Anita, how are you doing? Um, this short video is about how you can decorate your table for special occasions. We've got some friends coming round for supper tonight, so I just thought I'd show you some of my tricks that I use. So first of all, what I like to do with a table setting is use candles of different height. So very low candles and then very long candles. And I quite like the different um, visual effect that this gives and um, I've used candles, coloured candles, which I've bought from Tiger Tiger to match with the table setting. The other thing I love doing is putting together very matte fabrics and textures with shiny textures and um, fabrics. So for instance here, um, with the tablecloth and napkins, yes, they don't match, but that's not a problem. You could have everything matchy-matchy, or I have put a paisley with a chevron with a floral and I actually think it works quite well and, 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 and I like what I've done there. So that's sort of the matte element to the table and then I put shine in the crockery. So I've got um, ceramic uh, cup and saucer with this lovely effect and I've got some dotted effect around the side plate and then some embellishment on these water cups and then I just want to also show you I've got a mottled glass vase here which also looks lovely so lots of different textures work really well together the other thing I love doing on a table setting is putting warm fairy lights warm fairy lights tend to cast a yellow glow and they are so much nicer than cool lights which tend to be blue and then I hide the unsightly battery pack in a little uh, Voltive. The other thing um, I like to do is put fresh flowers on the table. So you can get lots of seasonal flowers. So whatever your um, colour theme is, you can always buy flowers to sit in well with that theme. And then if you want to have a bit of fun with your guests, you could put some little party props on the table setting. So I've got a little beard here, some hot red lips, and then some geeky glasses, which I love. And uh, also just on each of the table settings, I've put either an acorn or a pretty little sequin bird. And then if you come round here with me, follow me round, I've actually put the sweet little sequin birds clipped on to the edge of the napkins. And finally, I've got three mirrored um, placemats, which I love because what they do is add a bit more depth to the table because they reflect everything that's on it up and it just, just creates, creates another visual interest. So I hope you like what I've done with the table. So the key things to remember is have candles at different height, Think about lots of texture, think about matte and shine, um, warm fairy lights are always better than cool fairy lights, and have some fun with your guests. Bye!